This is a video, uh, I'm about to show you some footage of us getting kicked out of the Motel 6 because um, my girlfriend was wearing a sports bra and one of the managers had a problem with that. It's completely legal. Officers were called yesterday and they said that she was not uh, being indecent whatsoever and actually said that the manager needed to act like a manager and that she was uh, exhibiting disorderly conduct. And they left. So this morning at 11 o'clock when you normally check out of a hotel, um, they called us and was like, oh, well, you know, we'll give you your money back if you check out now. But we paid for two days of being in that motel, so we didn't capitulate. They actually had to tear the door. Uh, they had to break the door open because we refused to leave. And we refused to leave until the police came there, and they respectfully asked us to leave. Um, they didn't think that the woman was doing the right thing. Anyway, um... So, I would not press charges because it's just proof to me that in America, you really don't own anything anyway. The banks own it. And any time you break any one of these so-called rules that are really all about business and about appearances and looking good, they're not about freedom, then you lose everything you have. We had paid for another night at that place, but because this one woman who had some sort of ego battle with us or some sort of problem what we were doing uh, wanted us to leave. We had to leave. We had no rights. Of course, we could take her to court and we would probably win. But there's a bigger point to prove here. And that's simple. You don't own anything in America. The banks own your house. And the minute you stop making payments because you're a slave to the bank, you get kicked out of your house. And in an apartment, you could have paid a whole a whole year's lease, two years' lease, it don't matter. And if you break one of their little laws that they created on top of America's laws, which are not supported by American law, they can kick you out even though you've paid. You don't own anything. You're not truly free. Housing actually makes takes away your freedom. So anyway, watch this footage. Yes. You're on camera. Okay. Dude, sir, we've asked you guys to leave these out yesterday. We've got you on camera, ma'am. We've got you on camera. You, we've got you on camera, and you're acting foolish. Can you break this? Hey, sweetie. What what law did we break? What what law have we broken, ma'am? We're done. Okay, come out now, because you could have gotten a refund for today. Okay, you can We're break our door down and come in here and try to force us door. out. This is our hotel. We, okay, break. Hey, hey, ma'am. 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 Listen, you, you haven't told us... You haven't told us what uh, law we violated of Motel 6 yet. Can you show us on the record book that it's wrong to wear a sports bra? You don't want this on video, but it's on video, and you can get in a lot of trouble. We also contacted the corporate uh, headquarters and filed a complaint about you. That, that I wore a sports bra by the pool? That I wore a sports bra by the pool? I wore a, I wore a sports bra by the pool, ma'am. I did right. nothing wrong. She didn't do anything wrong. I did nothing wrong. I wore a sports bra by the pool. Nobody filed any, com nobody complained. You're the only one. Listen, let's make peace with her. Hey, we want to make peace with you. We tried to. We tried to. I tried to go on the change, and you would not let me. Do you believe in? Do you believe in Jesus? But we're supposed to be peacemakers, ma'am. The one of the fruits of God's Holy Spirit is peace. Would you say what you're doing is peaceful? Would you say what you're doing is peaceful? If she tries to forcibly pick us up and move us, do not, do not react. Don't let her do it. Do you think this will stand up in a court of law? 
You're on video right now. Go ahead and say your piece. I wore a sports bra at the pool yesterday. It wasn't a sports bra, and it wasn't. It was. It wasn't. The police said it was a sports bra. Two police said it was a sports bra. Go ahead. You can't strip down this bed. You can't move us. You're leaving. No, we're not. No, we're not. And this is a violation of human rights. It's a violation of human rights. I was wearing a sports bra, which wasn't illegal, and two cops said it was a sports bra. And they called and apologized. They said they were only being nice because of your condition. They said you were being disorderly and you should act like a manager. Yes, they did. We were here. Yes, they did. You can take pictures all day long. These are pictures. These are We are. This is a I want you to tell me what courtesy law we broke here. We will. We're going to have a good day right here on your bed, man. Because we, we paid, for, paid it. for this room for a night and we did nothing wrong. Nothing. Do you want to go to jail for her, sir? Because you're violating human rights. We wore, I wore a sports bra at the pool and did nothing wrong. You keep saying that all day long. It's, it's true. It's it would, true. It would be better to get fired than go to jail. I'm not, I'm not going to jail. I'm not yeah, you will. You will. A sports bra, man. A sports, a sports bra. bra. A sports and bra. Our neighbors think you're ridiculous. I mean, it was like this. You can see right through No, no, you cannot see right through it. It was a sports bra that any woman will wear out jogging in the summer. Come on, folks. It was a sports bra. Now they're sitting up in the bed. And the police, and the police said that there was nothing, nothing wrong. We're jokes. We're jokes. If you put We're me jokes. on a video, I'll sue you because I got your name. We just, yeah, we can sue you hey, too, ma'am, for is, what you've done. Hey, this is media, ma'am. We have free we have free press in America. Freedom of press. You can't put anything on about me anyway. I certainly can. Yes, yes we can. We, we certainly can. Yes, we can. Now, no, better not. We will. We will, and we are. You need to calm down and make peace with us, or we will. If if you would make peace, these won't go on YouTube. These won't go to court. There's no peace. You need to leave. All right. You're leaving. the one that doesn't want peace. You've been asked to leave. No, if we paid for something, we're not trespassing. No. no, we paid for two nights here, and I wore a sports bra at the pool. You were offered a refund. You were asked to leave. It was all done nicely and politely, and you refused. No, ma'am. The cops came here and said that you... The cops came here and said that you were being disorderly and said that you need to act like a manager. Yeah, that's Yeah, right, we have I'm no, sure, we I'm have sure. no, we have no proof There's of that. There's no record of that. That's your That's hearsay. Fine. What we do have record of is that they were standing here and said it right in front of us that okay. you were being disorderly. Okay. Someone's gonna believe you guys. People who are holed up in a hotel room won't come out even though you're trespassing. Yeah, our neighbors believe us. Yeah. They saw it. Oh, oh, okay. oh, insulting your guests. That's real nice. Yes, you're trespassing. We got that on video too. We got that too. on video too. Did you pay for the room? Yes. yes we did. I w yes, yes, we did. I wore a sports bra at the pool yesterday afternoon, mm -hmm. and she accosted me. I said I would go change, and she said, no, we're escorting you okay, up I'm here. I'm not to get sure what that's got to do with, did you pay for the room? Today? Yes. Yes, we did. We have the receipt. We have the receipt. Let me see. Okay. Yeah. It's in your bag, I think. We have the receipt. You can she look at it from my hands, but I will not allow you to have it. You can she read called, it out of my hand. She called the police yesterday. The police came, said that she had no right, that she was being disorderly, and that we were I'm doing nothing wrong. I'm not going to take it. I don't need to take it. Let me look at it probably. Move your hands. I, I can't allow you to move, do that. Move it's my receipt. Here, just, just you look at it. so I can receipt. read it. Okay. There you go. I'm sorry for yelling at you. It's just a stressful situation. And you situation. paid for the room. Yes. Yes, we did. Okay. Yes, we did. Thank okay. you. It was a sports bra, man. The police came out here and said that she was being disorderly and that she needed to act like a manager.
we're creating a scene. She's not creating a scene. Let's, let's talk to her. Again. I mean, literally. We're on their list. Right, let me ask you. Mm -hmm. Yes. Why is it that you want to stay here when, when at this point? Because because it's paid, human rights. We paid for the room, and there's no reason why we should be kicked out. She didn't do anything wrong. I did, I did nothing wrong. And the cops said something. Mm -hmm. If you are at the pool, mm -hmm. obscenely dressed. I was not obscenely dressed. She the wasn't, cops said that I was not obscenely dressed. Yes. By my sta our standards, our hotel standards, if it is obscenely dressed, you will be under criminal trespass. Let me see well, the policy. Ma'am, can we see the policy, the policy that says... Yes. Okay. Let's see it. Okay, policy. please. Sure. All right, we want to see. Okay. I do not want you here in our hotel. Mm -hmm. Okay. At this point, you're mm -hmm. causing a disturbance. No, she's causing a no, disturbance, ma'am. Right. I was wearing a sports bra, which you, if you go out, you will see women jogging in them. Mm -hmm. If you go to that gym up right across the street, show her your you. sports bra. Okay, I'll show it to you. It. It's not against the, the law. The cops you can said see it. There is nothing you wrong with what she's wearing. Here. Like, at least be. Do you understand? She didn't do anything against you. A string, a string Listen, bikini. You're talking about human rights. Mm -hmm. Be cognizant of the rights of children. Also, of the cops of what came and are. said that the cops We're came. Very cognizant two police of officers came and said nothing is indecent about what she's wearing. That's right. Two police officers. When are you due to check out? Tomorrow. Tomorrow morning. at eleven. Eleven o'clock tomorrow right, morning. Well, let me go. I'm going to deal with this in a minute. Okay. okay.